Hi guys, good day, Mark here again, and welcome back to my channel. So, uh, if you love cars, DIYs, and anything car related, please consider subscribing and check out my playlist. So, um, guys, it's been a while since I uploaded a video. Uh, as I mentioned on the groups, or rather my page, uh, there's really nothing much that I can do um, on my Eon right now because uh there's no maintenance to do uh, but early this morning i actually noticed when the uh, air can compressor kicked in i noticed a uh, squeaking sound so i'm pretty sure it's not the the bearing it's uh possible that the belt so i did check the tension of the belt so it's a bit loose uh, I do have a video already of uh, the uh, DIY tension adjustment, but I just wanted to show you guys the actual adjustment of the tension for the uh, Aircan compressor drive belt. Alright guys, so the Aircan uh, compressor drive belt is actually that one, the, the green, uh, the belt that has a green uh, mark. So that's the one. We wanted to adjust so I'm um, actually halfway already done if you could see I do have the wrench already there uh, so let me just place you guys on where you can see what I'm doing So, sorry guys, uh, I still don't have a mic um, for you guys to better hear me. So, I'm just going to reach out the uh, wrench that I have. So, first step that you wanted to do is um, loosen up the uh, pivot uh, bolt. So, this is actually the one holding the uh, compressor. show to you guys what the okay so this is the uh, this is the tension here this one and then the pivot bolt is right I'm not sure if you guys can see my finger so the pivot bolt <laughs> is right underneath the uh, hose one eternity later all right guys so i'm underneath the car um i'm actually having a hard time adjusting the uh, belt on the top because uh the the ratchet that i'm using is quite big so uh i'm actually uh, I already turned the uh, uh, tension air bolt a couple of times already, but just to show you guys, this is how you do it. See? Okay, so I'm just gonna check the tension on the top. Uh, let me see. We should be able to uh, move the uh, uh, belt at least a uh, quarter, uh, three quarters of an inch. Okay. Okay, looks tight. So I'm just going to leave you guys here uh, and check the tension. On top
All right. So it's a bit tight. Let me just loosen. Loosen it a couple of turns. Attention. Okay. All right. So that's just about right. Now it's time to tighten the uh, pivot bolt. Okay. Let's go. So time to uh, finish the job. So done. Alright, so that's the uh, pivot fold. Let me see if. Okay. Alright, so that's the pivot fold. Uh, that one. Okay. Alright, so. Time to um, starve the engine. All right, guys. So just finished adjusting the uh, tension of the uh, AC drive belt. So. Uh, I'm almost certain that it's not gonna squeak right now because it's still uh, it's actually a bit hot because uh, I used it a while ago um, but if uh, just in case you know that I wasn't able to tighten it correctly then we should hear a uh, squeaking noise regardless if it's hot or cold but uh, I will give a feedback tomorrow morning um when i start the engine but for now we're uh gonna give it a go we're gonna test it and uh i'm actually gonna start it uh while the door is open because when uh, i wanted to hear once the uh, ac compressor kicks in if there will be a uh, squeaking noise let's go ahead and start Alright, so moment of truth. I don't hear anything. So far, so good. Alright, so yeah, um, Gonna, so that's actually compressor off. Let me switch it on again. Yeah, I don't hear any squeaking noise, but again, the moment of truth or the true test would be tomorrow morning with a cold start. So I'm gonna give you guys a feedback uh, after that or tomorrow, okay? Let me just close the a few moments later all right guys so it's hot it's actually two in the afternoon so it's really hot outside um i hope you guys love the video or like the video if you do please give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed yet please please consider subscribing and check out my playlist also if you need carp uh eon spare parts specifically and then so iridium twin tip performance spark plugs you might want to visit my facebook page it's mark anthony reyes um and you should be able to see the feedbacks and also the uh, parts that i'm selling online uh cash on delivery cash on pickup is also available uh, again this is mark uh thank you so much for joining me today guys see you on the next vlog